Carpe Opticus. Well, we're in for a special treat today because I have a brand new thermal from Fusion Thermal. This is the Avenger 40. It arrived yesterday. I'm just now getting around to unboxing it. I'm very excited about this. I met Chris, the owner of Fusion Thermal, at the Precision Rifle Expo down outside of Houston earlier this year. He talked me through the features that are on their thermal scopes, the ideas behind the manufacturing process that went into them, the decisions they made and why. And I was quite impressed with some of the decisions that they'd made on, on doing their scopes. This isn't something they've taken lightly. And I'm getting a chance to try out the Avenger 40, which is part of their new line of scopes. They have video and audio capabilities along with photo capabilities, of course. And this is going to be the midline scope of the Avenger series. There's one beneath it and then the 55 that's above it. This is the 40. It's a 384 resolution scope. Coming in at about 22 and a, uh, let's see, 22.4 ounces. Let's take a look at what's inside the box. Nice packing material. Very cool manual, nicely bound. And generally very professionally done, it looks like. All the normal stuff, looks like a sticker, maybe a warranty card. These have a five year transferable warranty, which is absolutely outstanding. Lens cleaning cloth. Let's see, USB cable. There are one, two, Plastic boxes. These are actually battery holders. This site runs on two 18650 thermal batteries at a time for about a nine hour run time. You've got these nice little carrying boxes. You can carry them, all four of them, in their own box. Load up the scope when you get it on site and you're good to go. Of course, with the batteries, got a nice battery charger and its USB cable. And then we have the scope itself. Check this out. This is the Avenger 40. Comes with a quick release Unity mount. Got the power button on the side. The record buttons on the top right next to the battery compartment. There's a USB port. Scope runs off of the three buttons, except for the power, of course. And the menu button in the middle, which is also the nuke button, is raised up considerably from the other button so that you can feel it, even with gloves on, no problem. It's got a nice Tenebrakes lens cap. This can be rotated around and it's notched so that it will stay in position, which is nice. And one of my favorite features from looking at the scope at the Precision Rifle Expo was the focus. This actually has detent in it and each of the focus or focal selections click into place. No more of this having a very stiff focusing knob and trying to focus on your animal and going past it and trying going back the other way and going too far past it back the other direction. With this, you get one click past it, you realize your picture's going out of balance and you just do one click back and you're perfectly in focus. Very, very cool feature. I'm really going to like that. Nice scope. This is going to go on to a 6.5 Grindel rifle, although these are rated for 300 Win Mag. I'm going to be putting it on a 6.5 Grindel. I've got a new upper that I'm going to be testing out with a massive 28-inch barrel, so this should be very interesting. So tomorrow we're going to get to the range, get a chance to take a look at the menu system on the scope. I saw this when I was at the show, and it is pretty neat. While some scopes use symbols or a combination of symbols and words. This scope uses pretty much all words in its menu system. So you don't have any questions about whether the X or Y coordinate is up or down or left or right. 
it tells you up or down or left or right. You know, every everything is described with a word, so as long as you speak English, you are good to go. Very nice feature, takes away a lot of the extra thinking and confusion that comes with trying to get these sighted in sometimes. And for the battery compartment, nice big handle to unscrew. Pops open, takes two 18650 batteries, and you're good to go. And that's the brief unboxing of the Avenger 40 from Fusion Thermal. We're off to the range tomorrow. Carpe sus, my friends.